Hello everybody, welcome back. Yeah, no, it's, a, it's just the best temple. Interesting. Yet another map. That construct! I made it long ago. But the glow... It must be under the control of something monstrous. If the Demon King has turned my creation into his pawn, we must defeat it. We can do this together, Link. We will not be able to force our way past the defenses. We must think of something else.
dangerous. <sighs> Be careful. Maybe we can make use of the devices around us. Oh God. It brought out more arms. Be careful. <laughs> Oh, well, their spirit was in my... Okay. Are they some sort of cat? Zelda asked me to aid you, Link. I am the Sage of Spirit, and one of the Zonai. God. Link. 
I am glad to meet you, Lake. I must thank you. It is because of you that we have recovered my secret stone. Originally, my intent was to awaken when you first found the Porapad, then to guide you to my construct and assist you on your journey. I had not anticipated a battle with that same construct. You have proven quite adept, and I am grateful for all your efforts. Link, here. In the name of Minoru, Sage of Spirit, I grant my power unto you. I believe it will serve you well. We got the last infinity stone, I think. Oh, yeah. With this power I've given, a deep bond has been forged between us. And from this point forward, my spirit will reside within that construct. I will help you however I can. Aha! I am one who lived in the distant past in the age of Hyrule's founding. Circumstances forced me to forsake my body and become a being of pure spirit. Long has passed, I have slumbered within Zelda's pure pad in order to share what I knew when it passed into your hands. I apologize for our meeting it has been delayed. The Demon King's inference is flame. Nevertheless, I ask you a pardon. Well then. Now, on the topic of hand, at hand. In my own age, the distant past, from your perspective, Zelda awakened as a, the age of time and appeared before us. What I must relate to you is the tr a tragedy that occurred in Hyrule's history. At its crux was Zelda, who ha held a secret stone to traverse time. She made a momentous decision in these days gone by. I would have you know of the resolve that poured into the mas blade the Master Sword. Long ago... My people, known as the Zonai, came down from the heavens to the surface of the world. Seven. It was said they were descendants of gods. They bore treasures from these same gods, secret stones capable of amplifying the abilities of those who possessed them. Using the knowledge of the Zonai, my younger brother Raru became a great leader. He met a young woman named Sonia, and they would wed. Raru gifted Sonia one of the secret stones. Together, they sought to establish their kingdom. This is how the kingdom of Hyrule, with Raru and Sonia as its first king and queen, came to be. The future looked bright. However, tragedy suddenly struck. A man of great evil emerged from the desert. The leader of the Gerudo, Ganondorf, killed Queen Sonia and stole her secret stone. Using the secret stone, Ganondorf transformed into the Demon King. He then created swarms of monsters and attacked. Hyrule rose up to face these threats. But the evil power driving the monsters forward was staggering. The defenders were on the brink of defeat. Raru then came up with a plan to turn the tide of the war. He entrusted secret stones to warriors with exceptional abilities. They became sages and united in an effort to finally defeat the Demon King. Raru and the sages outnumbered the Demon King, and should have been able to stop him. 
However... The Demon King's power had grown far beyond anything we could have imagined. I was unable to withstand his strength. Our fight appeared all but lost. And then, Rogan. committed himself to one final act. See a third eye. He had a third eye. So smug. I know exactly what it will cost me. Uh, Raru! <laughs> Thousands of years will pass on the blink of an eye. You only delay the inevitable. You're wrong. Years from now, someone will appear with the sword that seals the darkness. A swordsman with the power to defeat you, Link. Remember this name. Hmm. You know this tragedy as the imprisoning war. Though it took all we were able to give, we success succeeded in imprisoning the Demon King. But I was wounded in the process, my body would soon expire. That is when Zelda came to me bearing a decayed and broken sword. Yes, you will recall the Master Sword. Van vanished from your hand in the Temple of Time. From there, I traveled into the distant past, appearing in Zelda's hand. And now, you hold it once again. You're saying that sword traveled through time the same way you did? Yes, but more importantly, in my original time, the Demon King was vulnerable to even the smallest piece of this sword. Even someone like him has vulnerabilities. Hmm. Then, what exactly are you suggesting we do with the sword? Over time, the Master Sword is able to absorb sacred power. It can heal itself, and even grow stronger. Curious. If we were able to empower it in that way, it could be the key to defeating the Demon King. But it could take centuries for that sword to grow strong enough. The power the Demon King wields. I do not see how this can be done. 
It would be impossible for you to provide it with sacred power for so long. I can think of one way. You mean... Yes, I can do it. I have to. I've told you. That act is forbidden for a very good reason. It would mean throwing yourself away. <laughs> oh, Maru. You won't be able to change back. Does that mean she's the dragon? The moment I had the sword, I knew what to do. I knew this was why I came to this era. I... I want to restore the Master Sword and deliver it to Link. You really have made up your mind? <sighs> Very well then. As a Zonai, I bear my share of blame for these events. So I too will devote myself to this goal and to this hero of yours. For the Swordsman Link, I will do everything I can. Even if my body should perish, I will still be with you in spirit. The way she made it sound, it made it sound like she was the dragon. Uh -huh. Afterwards, Zelda and I discussed strategy. We laid the groundwork of guiding you to the distant future. Before the gloom's affliction took my life, I became a spirit and entered the Pearl Then Zelda did what she felt she must, and began the forbidden process. She believed you would use the Master Sword to defeat the Demon King and restore peace to Hyrule. Uh -huh. You already have in hand the hope that Zelda left for you, the sword that seals the darkness, the Master Sword. Well then. Go now, Link. The sword with the sword of hope that Zelda left you to you, you will surely smite and defeat the game, Demon King. Does that or does that not mean she's the dragon? Like what happened to her? Vow of Rumor's Stage Spirit, proof of the Vow of the Spirit Construct. New class, Trial of the Master Sword. Oh, it is. Okay. This is getting interesting, I'm not gonna lie. Oh yeah, we got the gang now. <laughs> I 
And let's see what this whole thing is about. Yeah, because we still have a missing thing, so... That's clear- that's clearly Raru is the thing. Tears of the Kingdom, okay. Yes. No? Where was Raru's tier? <laughs> I thought it was right there, but it might be in his head? Oh god, are these all memories? Have I been missing these this entire time? Yep. What? We didn't mean to startle you. I'm sorry. It's okay. My name is Sonia. And could we ask what your name is? I... I am the daughter of King Rome of Hyrule, Zelda. What an unexpected answer. <sighs> we are the king and queen who founded Hyrule after all. Or at least we were the last time I checked. You two founded Hyrule? And you're the king? Mm. My name is Raru. King Raru of Hyrule. King Raru? And Queen Sonia? Uh, but that must mean... Well, shit.
I guess we won't be defeating Ganon sooner than I expected. I think you looked distracted. What's wrong? I'll tell you all about it, Impa. There was a bunch, there was a gangbang and this and that. Oh. Yeah, we'll see you guys in the next episode. I'm gonna go pee and then I'm gonna friggin' look for cliffs, I guess.